Khan filming in Abu Dhabi at the brand new Warner Brothers World, which just happens to open up today. Um, but look at this location, mind blown. Here with Anand, an incredible parkour athlete. We're walking through everything and making sure it's awesome for you guys because we're in Bedrock. Take advantage of it from the zone. So they're blocking everything out. Once we do get everything we need here, we can just go super fast. We're in Bronco Burger, so if you look back here, this is where Fred Flintstone family, this is where they eat. So we're just doing a bunch of different things. We're jumping through the window, we're playing on statues, and then they're actually gonna climb up here. And the athlete's gonna run and then climb out one of those windows. And then he jumps out the awning. Even Zane's smiling, because Zane didn't know we were doing all that. On, and we are heading to Dynamite Gulch, famous from Wile E. Coyote, Roadrunner, and several other Warner Brothers characters. Anon, tell us what's going on right now, walk and talk. So right now we're trying to just block out uh, what the character, the parkour character is going to be doing as he's running from Bedrock here. From Warner Brothers World, now he came to Moab. We love Moab, we always film. What? We're not in Moab. Oh, this isn't Moab after all. Day number two filming in Abu Dhabi at Warner Brothers World. We're actually on location at Gotham City. Which come over here for a minute. I am out of all Warner Brothers IP brand stuff. Batman's my favorite superhero, like, without question. So filming here to me is a big deal because this place actually looks like Gotham City. You can experience over there. Now there is so much attention to detail. Um, Mr. Freeze, one of the main bad guys in the Batman universe. If you want to get ice cream, it makes sense to go to Mr. Freeze's Ice Cream Shack. I'm not sure the technical term on it. But just look over here. Everything look is, looks like it's been frozen over by Mr. Freeze himself. It actually looks like it belongs somewhere in the winter tundra. But everything just has a theme. Everything is so thought out. That was a big thing for Warner Brothers World, is attention to detail. So everything you see looks like a real movie set. It is. So we're filming the scene when we see Catwoman for the very first time, and these guys are killing it. Action! Riddler ride and we are filming the next scene with Catwoman and Dom and things are going well. And every character here at Warner Brothers are all based off of the comic, the new 52 comics. Here we go! Ready and action! Stand up. Run! Cut! What's going on here, man? Right now, I'm doing a flip and then getting disorientated and running into Tasmanian Devil. Are you ever gonna do like any parkour moves in this video? No, I'm probably just gonna just walk around and run. Oh. It's actually, it's just good. My dad was a marathon runner, so I was just born for this. Taz loves being on camera, am I right? <laughs> Three, two, one, action! Cut! Devin, is Taz your favorite character? You better say yes. <laughs> what are you about to do, Dom? I am going to prep the slide under the anvil to see if it works. I want to go under and then over the turnstile. We are actually in the Warner Brothers World lobby. We are filming when Dom runs in it for the first time. So we just have a bunch of characters, we have a bunch of extras, and a bunch of workers. We're saying this as if it's happening right before the park. Oh, and look at Jeff, one of our fearless creative directors. Wait. So you fake it till you make it in Hollywood. This is an anvil, it's not as heavy as it looks. Devin is the mastermind behind all creation right now. He's lighting, he's rigging, he's casting, he's filming, director of photography, so many positions filled by Devin right now. And action, action! Solid.
Dom, where are you at right now? We are in the Hall of Justice, and it is surreal. Surreal. Yeah? Uh, I mean, <laughs> really feels like you're submersed in the universe when you're in here. The music, the picturesque like setting is just amazing. <laughs> Dream come true, really. Look at all these awesome heroes. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so we got Fred Flintstone. Flintstones were one of my favorite cartoons growing up, that and the Jetsons. So we are really grateful we got the man, the myth, the legend here at Bedrock. What do you have to say for yourself, Fred? Yabba-dabba-doo! Yeah, yabba time. I think that was what that meant. So here we got Barney from Bedrock. Sadly, he's not with Fred right now, but he is getting some food because they have some incredible food at Warner Brothers World. It's actually kind of world renowned as far as I'm concerned. He'll be eating some food at Bronto Burgers, so you guys are just trying to feature as many cool things you can experience at Warner Brothers World. Stay tuned. Don, what's going to happen? I'm going to dive through this window and steal some fries. Hungry. We're filming. We're trying to film the Barney slowing us down because he wants some veggies, Pronto burgers. But we got to work with what we got. Um, Dom is going to go to a stunt gag. Want to eat them? Grab the French fries. That's probably a perfect placement, yeah. Mm -hmm. Then he's going to run and climb up because he's running from the security guard. But you always get hungry when you're running, so Dom is going to get some food and everything's going to be perfect. This has definitely been my favorite scene to shoot so far. Free meal in the middle. In Abu Dhabi with some absolutely incredible local parkour talent, a couple others from around the world. I do parkour for fun. Uh, and I just enjoy parkour, like people's reactions of like, wow. Oh. I'm from Pakistan and Boone and I've been in parkour, free running, uh, some photography, videography, and I'm just <laughs> He takes pictures. So, the language, there's definitely a little language barrier every once in a while, but I just love the different cultures. Everyone's working together to tell a story, and that's what this project has been. There's so many people from so many different countries all coming together in Abu Dhabi with Warner Brothers World to make this project happen. Five, I lost track out in Abu Dhabi at Warner Brothers World. This is Dom from Australia, an absolutely incredible athlete. We have been requesting 18, 20 hour days from Dom, and Dom still has a smile on him. So, what do you have to say, Dom? How was it? Uh, I love working with you guys, man. It, it, being passionate about a project like this is surreal, and uh, being able to jump around a location like this is hot metal. Normally, you're not allowed to do this just for the record, but we did get special permission. We did this with Warner Brothers World, and we're super glad that Dom could do it. So, I got Yosemite Sam in person. Yosemite Sam, high five, big fan. And then I got Marvin the Martian. He was actually always one of my favorites. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, action! Three, two, one, pull! Cut! That was fake, guys. Cut! Get the cut for dog! Hey, oh my gosh! Did I make it? Did you write your head yet? No. I'm, gonna write, I'm waiting for it. Here we go. Get up. Get ready. Okay, camera's rolling. And action! Tunes are absolutely incredible. Wildy Coyote, the ultimate diva, the hardest character we've ever worked with. Would we do it again? Absolutely. High five. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. This is how you tell us true friendship. Don't, don't touch the characters, please. Get out of here. Batman is about to come down. He's ready. Um, and watch and learn.
guy that made this project happen. Jeff, tell us your role in this project and how it went down. So I was the creative director for the grand opening of Warner Brothers World Abu Dhabi. The first time I walked through this amazing park, I thought of Devon. Warner Brothers World Abu Dhabi is amazing. I started working at theme parks when I was 14. Uh, I've worked in the industry for a long time. You see the gray hair. And the theming in this park is just beyond anything I've experienced before. You literally feel like you're in bedrock. I mean, I had a, a Pronto burger tonight. I sat there and I felt like I was in bedrock. And when you step into Gotham City, you just get the chills. So here we are at the brand new Warner Brothers World in Abu Dhabi, which this place is absolutely incredible and it just opened. I'll have links down below in the description to check out this park and you'll actually get to meet Batman and the evil villains from everything Warner Brothers World. It is absolutely incredible. Get on that. Thank you so much for watching. Over and out, baby.